Hey folks, uh, Derek here back with another Psychedelic Tessin. And today I've chosen a record that I consider a lost uh, English pop psych uh, masterpiece very seriously. Um, I absolutely love this album and um, for the life of me do not understand why it is not on the same level as uh, Small Faces, Ogden, Ogden's Not Gone Flake or any of those albums from that period. Uh, Zombies, Odyssey and Oracle, this is right there with them and that is Fillmore Lincoln's The North Wind Blew South. Now there's no credits on here but it is rumored that the Yardbirds or members of the Yardbirds and possibly Jimmy Page are among the uh, session musicians on this album. Regardless of if it's them or not, whoever's playing made a dream of an album. From the very first strokes of the violins at the beginning of this album through to the end, this record is almost, in my opinion, perfect English psychedelic pop from the late 60s going into the 70s. Um, he wrote the song Tema Harbor, which Mary Hopkin on the Apple label had a minor hit with. And she pretty much lifted his arrangement. It really didn't change it much at all. And so I guess they just needed a girl's voice instead of his because his version, the original, which is on here, is gorgeous. As far as Trip Out Meter, this is not a Trip Out album, but what this more is, is it's like the cover. It's pastoral. It's got that dreamy um, uh, Sherwood Forest, forest kind of mythical um, atmosphere to it. Um, got it right. I'm amazed there's only one record and that it sank without a trace, apparently. Uh, I've looked online for information about this album and have just found very little. Um, probably ought to look again to see if someone has updated things because I don't know whatever happened to Mr. Lincoln. But um, the songs that I particularly, particularly love are the first opening track, The North Wind Blue South, um, Early Sherwood. You know, I mentioned Sherwood Forest. Well, the song Early Sherwood captures it it's 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 lyrical it's it's it, you know i guess maybe it was probably thought of as possibly a little twee or gay sounding at the time because it's delicate and it's pretty but it's magical sounding that's what i hear i hear ma that magical sound what i look for in all kinds of music i'm always looking for magic moments and this one has it rainy day Another magical song on here for me is The Plains of Delight. Um, again, I believe you can go on YouTube on this channel and search this and hear some songs. This is a wonderful, wonderful, wonderful album from the 60s and definitely qualifies as one to be featured here in the Psychedelic Atessin because if you've not heard this and you give it a shot and you like psychedelia, It'll take you to another world. A very nice one. This is a fabulous, fabulous album. Um, I'm trying to think who else to uh, refer to. And I don't want to misspeak, but it's just got many elements of what I consider classic late 60s British pop. You know, I'm even thinking of the Yardbirds, although they don't sound like the Yardbirds. It's just damn good really well played, really well arranged, and its voice is very dreamlike. I highly recommend this album, The North Wind Blue South by Fillmore Lincoln. Um, that's that's what I want to share with you this for this uh, delicatessen, all right, folks? Leave comments.